Useful shot against the spin is advancing down the wicket and hitting aerially over the top. Ideally looking for a six. You might find the fielders are slightly in or you're playing with a short boundary. The advance <laughs> is a head and shoulder move down the wicket, a large first step in a straight line. Hands are taken back and high. We click the back foot into the front foot to keep us sideways. And then a second step forward creates the final base for the shot. With the head and front shoulder forward, the hands and the bat come accelerating through the ball and we connect just in front of us, which is what gives us the aerial part of the shot. There's a temptation to want to try and hit the ball too hard and to try and force it into the air. But really, to get the ball up, it's about connecting a little bit earlier. The weight still stays forward, and you can see there, you can still get decent power and elevation without really trying to do it. Timing will do it for you. A good practice drill for learning to hit over the top is a drop feed. And your feeder needs to drop from a height with tennis balls two of your stride widths apart and it's your aim to get there on the second bounce of a clean strike. Just by keeping my back foot parallel allows me to keep a side on shape and that means my bat can go on a full and clean straight line through the ball. If I was to turn this back toe, get my hip coming round, I'd really struggle to hit the ball straight, and there's every chance I might be getting caught in at mid-wicket. Once you're happy with your foot movement and your contact coming down and hitting a drop feed, we can add in an element of judgment and perception. Feeder goes back a little bit further, he's going to lob up the ball, so you've now got to advance towards it, but it's exactly the same technique. <laughs> 